Hello everyone and welcome to my YouTube channel. Today's video is going to be kind of short and sweet, but I wanted to give you guys an update on my Small World dolls created by Anderson Art Dolls. Um, the head itself, if you're new here, this head itself is an actual, it's a Small World animatronic head. And I have been working on putting all the pieces together to make them um, park authentic. and. I got this yellow wig uh, for this doll. I'm going to make her kind of like a Holland doll, I guess. And it is really like um, not very thick. I got it from AliExpress, but you can see it's got like the knit here on the back and then some real thin yarn here. But what I think I'm gonna do is buy more yarn and kind of make it a lot fuller over on the top, which should be pretty easy to do. Um, I just didn't want to start from absolute scratch and try to make something, but today I have a brown wig for the actual uh, head. It's a brown, like, short wig, and I've got these clothes. Now, my friend Leah was telling me, she's like, hear me out, what about, like, Disney baby clothes? And I was like, no, not at all. And then I saw this advertisement from Janie and Jack with this little Mickey Mouse polo shirt and Mickey Mouse shorts and I bought it and I messaged her and I was like, well, yeah, you were right. So these are like gonna be, I want to dress uh, this doll and make him into a boy until I get the actual, um, like the small world outfits. And I'm actually, I'm gonna change them a lot. It's not gonna be, you know, all the time they're dressed like right authentic but I wanted to change this one now and have like a little boy outfit to try on him. And also, because I have somebody lined up to make me outfits, but they can't start the commission until June of this year. So I'm gonna take the dress off. This is such a cute dress that uh, Sandy had picked out for the dolls and she kind of told me like the sizing and stuff. I have not attempted to undress them yet though. So we're gonna see how this is gonna go. Um, I shouldn't have to, oh, they have real buttons on the back. That's so sweet. So I'm gonna undress him, her, and make her into a him with the new outfit. And I think it's just super cute. And the Janie and Jack stuff is not the least expensive stuff on earth, but I gotta, I like, I had filled my cart up and then I abandoned it. And if you've ever done that, like you fill your cart and abandon it, sometimes they'll send you like a really good coupon depending on the company. And that's what happened. Like I got a good coupon and I was like, well, well, I guess I'll go ahead and do it and dress them up. And also I'm wearing my vintage, it's not actually vintage, it's vintage style um, Disney World shirt today. That was not planned. It just like worked itself out. Cause I was like, okay, what am I gonna put on to do this video and then I was like, you know what? This is actually perfect. All right, I gotta take these little shoes off. So the little shoes are actually gonna be the same ones I'm gonna put back on at the end of this. So let's see, let me seat him and then maybe I should have uh, tried this process before I started filming. Um, but I wanted you guys to kind of see the process along with me and I'm hoping the wig is going to work as well Like as this this it's a baby wig. They're for babies like for photo shoots with babies So I'm hoping this wig is going to work as well um, As the yellow one did let's see come on off come on off of there would you I might have to untie the shoes too I think I'm gonna have to untie them uh, to get them off I was, I was just trying to unzip and pull them off, but that didn't, that did not work. So, come on off, come on, come on off of there. And then we're gonna take, I'm hoping this is in the video. So I'm gonna take the tights off. So, I might should have done this in the floor so that you guys could see it a little better, but I was thinking to do it here on their display and see how that went. So, taking the little tights off, here's the actual body. Like, I haven't looked at it yet because it's been all dressed up the whole time, and that's sweet. So, I'm going to do the little shorts first. 
Um, so these are a six to 12 month short with little Mickey Mouses embroidered all over. Oh my gosh, I hope this fits. It's so cute. It's really, really cute. Let's see if it's gonna work. Okay, um, through the legs. And this reminds me of when I was at my friend Audrey's house and we were dressing her big, was it illusion doll? Those things are massive. Okay, so let me put the legs back in place to stand up now. Yes, this is gonna work. Oh my gosh. Move your arm back to the front, please. Let's see, and get your leg back in position. And then let me stand him back up. My little baby, my little baby. There's one leg and then two legs. Okay, and so now I'm gonna put, zip these up and button. Oh my gosh, that's adorable. That is really, really adorable. Stand up for me, sweetheart. Let's see. Okay. All right, and now, yeah, the fit is really good, actually. Like, look how cute that looks. Am I, am I in the way? Am I blocking the lighting? It's so cute. All right, so, and I like this because it looks like the collar buttons up really high. So it should cover the, um, like the neck area there, which is what the dolls do. So, I mean, what the actual ride does. Like it has the, all the animatronics, if you look at them, they all have that, like some kind of something in their clothing that's designed that way all right so let me and this I just thought look how cute that is sorry I keep bringing it too close for the light this light should be back farther let me fix that um but this is so cute like oh sorry this video is super informal by the way if you didn't figure that out um so I'm gonna put this on I'm not taking the tags off of these I'll just leave them on. Shouldn't, shouldn't bother the babies too much here. The small world babies. All right. I might should have taken the head off though to do this. We'll see how this works. All right. So just getting dressed here and then. Yeah, I probably. Could have made my life a little easier taking the head off, but I've already committed at this point, so we're gonna just continue. And then put the little arms through. Oh, I think this is gonna be so adorable. The little legs are moving all around on me. Let's see. I got it. There's a way you can get it just right to stand up. And I had them perfectly done before. Because I do like them stand. I decided, like, I was originally thinking I might just leave them seated, but I do like them better um, standing. They're very, they make a very nice display standing. I don't know how people with real live children dress their real live children because this is <laughs> this is difficult enough as it is. Imagine if he was fighting me every step of the way. Can you? All right. So his little polo. Oh my gosh, he's a little Disney preppy boy. Okay, hold on. Stand up for me. He is fighting me a little bit on standing up, but he will stand. I've had them him standing. There we go. Okay. I've actually got it now in position. Look how cute this looks. Oh my gosh. This is precious. This is so precious. And the little shirt buttons, it does button high enough to hide that 
that neckline oh my gosh this is the cutest the cutest and the shirt actually kind of matches like the lip color there so now let's see if the wig is going to work or not that's going to be a real test here because i do want him to have a wig so i've got it's a yarn wig made for a baby so let's see how this works come on fingers crossed that this is going to be as cute as i'm hoping and it's pretty cute it's not exactly what i would have wanted but it is super cute oh my gosh it's actually not that bad it is mm, that has a big red thread through it let me let me turn it the other way yeah i think that might be the back so maybe if i turn it the other way it's going to look a little better i mean it is a yarn wig it's not like a super fancy you know kind of wig here so all right there stand up sweetheart <gasps> look oh my gosh i think it's so cute i think he looks adorable like this really 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 i have to work on the wig i do want to get him a more this wig is not quite what i was hoping it would be um but it's something for now right so here he is in his new little outfit isn't he just as sweet as can be oh my gosh look at him <laughs> he looks really cute this little mickey mouse his little mickey mouse outfit oh my gosh he's precious okay guys i just wanted to show you that because i thought it would be fun to try it on and i do love it so i'm going to display him in this for a little bit um hope you enjoyed and we'll see you in the next video bye bye i want to say a huge thank you to my patrons from patreon Lindsay s leah w doreen z janice h mercedes w cindy k bear sunflower diane b kelly l shorna r stephanie w shalane c Penny P, Louisa's Knitnax, Marty G, Lynn, Lynn P, and Cindy L. Your support means so much to me and helps me continue bringing you great Dolly content. For more information on how you can become a supporter of this channel, check the link in the video description. Thank you.